How's it going, you sexy beast? My name is Horror Chief, and welcome back to Splinter Cell Pandora Tomorrow. That was pretty aggressive there from the start, wasn't it? <laughs> All right, mission complete. A recovered image of mortified penguin matched the CIA agent, sorry, the CIA record of an agency trained operative named Norman Soth. Though Echelon was unable to identify Soth as either a friendly or an enemy asset, Grimm's daughter successfully traced him to a train en route to Nice under the Elias Jonathan Poindexter. Is, that a, is Nice a plate? Okay. An additional 8,000 U.S. troops arrived in East Timor today in the biggest... Military intelligence released the information that Derrida Doa leader Suwadi Sadano was not only responsible but on site at the March 28th hostage crisis at the U.S. Embassy to East Timor. Headed by Abraham Zerkazi to reverse engineer the programs developed for the Georgian information crisis was declared a success by its U.N. Sporadic clashes with Derrida Doa guerrillas along the East Timor border. No U.S. casualties were... What do you think? The world is small, nasty, and complicated, and everybody dies alone. Hmm. What do you think about Norman Soth? He's small, nasty, and complicated. I guess how he'll die is up to him. I don't think Soth even knows whether or not he's still working for the CIA. I'm a good judge of character. That must be why we get along so well. Wow. We really doing this, huh? He is so badass, dude. I love Sam Fisher, man. Whew. We, where are we? Hes Hesperia Railways, Paris to Nice, France. Oh, oh, it is a pl Okay. CIA trade operative Norman Soth has been located in the South. Uh, oh, okay. Pretty much what we read on the last one. Locate and question South in order to determine his status as an enemy or a friendly operative. Chains bought up in this bitch! like you're in position. South is still your first and only objective. We need you to conversate the man face to face. The agency's got reams of data on him, but the man's history is a school of red herrings. Nobody knows whether he's a U.S. agent or a terrorist. Those things aren't mutually exclusive. Hippie. Until we know different, we're treating him as a friendly. So don't blow his cover. Any alarms mean mission over. If South sees you before you see him, the mission's over. Don't do anything to compromise him. Does that include killing him? Yeah. Leave him alive, if you don't mind. Updates on your opset. Shut the fuck up. Bitch, you are so lucky I ain't got anything else. You look lucky I love dogs. Oh, fuck you don't. I 
You, you should have shut the fuck up. Wow, you got quite this mustache right there. The Andrew Ryan type mustache. Not gonna lie, those kinds of mustaches look kind of... Oh my gosh. Can I climb on this thing? Oh my gosh, I can! I really hope we don't hit a bump. Oh, we saving. Good. We hit a bump, I am done. Another complication for you. Found the credit cards our man Poindexter, a.k.a. Soth, used to buy the train tickets. What's the complication? Two seats in coach. Looks like you have at least two terrorists mixed in with the civvies in the cheap seats. But you're dealing with tight quarters. I wouldn't risk anything lethal. You don't have the room to maneuver if there are complications. Hey, are you taking anything? Anything for what? You know, an account of the cargo. Shut up! What? Nobody here can... I'm not worried about these people, but if the boss hears us talking, neither of us is walking off this train. Hey, are you taking anything? Anything for what? What? Nobody here! I'm not worried about these people, but if the boss hears us talking, neither of us is walking off this train. Oh, son of a bitch! Malakath. Brunton's chums in the CIA came through for us. Soth's right leg has more prosthetics in it than Lee Majors. Apparently, he had a disagreement with a landmine. Might register different on thermal. Perfect. Monsieur, you requested earplugs? Ah, yes. I'm very sorry, but I couldn't find any. If your neighbors start shouting again, please feel free to call me and I'll ask them to be quiet. Thank you. I'm very sorry. That's him, right? Are you serious? Wake up, Poindexter. I knew that was him. First, you tell me, who are you? I'm your Uncle Sam. Come to make sure you're still one of the good guys. How do I trust you? Your name's Norman Soth. Ask me about the chestnut tree. Okay, fine. What are you doing here? If the men I'm with catch us talking, they'll kill us both. Then make your Sedona story fast. It's an agency job. The Joint Chiefs want a military presence in Indonesia, and I was part of the plan. That's all I can say. Who's your runner? Clifton Finch. 
What about the cryogenic slab? Uh oh. Sir? What is it now? You have a phone call. Stay hidden and don't make a noise. Sorry if I woke you. It's him. Is this a fresh phone? We put the chip in just an hour ago. Good, let's go to the bar car. I don't want to talk here. He was lying about his handler, wasn't he? Yeah. Finch has been on sick leave for 16 months. Hack the laptop now. And trail Soth. Laser mic that call. We still can't risk blowing Soth's cover. Fisher. What the hell? We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Damn. They know you're there. Mission's over. Get out of there. What? I did what you said. I'm very sorry, but I couldn't find any. Oh. If your neighbors start shouting. I just realized how I got caught. That one dude that I knocked out that was from the bathroom. That's how. Ah, stupid me. Again, please feel free to call me and I'll ask them to be quiet. Sorry if I woke you. It's him. Is this a fresh phone? We put the chip in just an hour ago. Good, let's go to the bar car. I don't want to talk here. He was lying about his handler, wasn't he? Yeah. Finch has been on sick leave for 16 months. Hack the laptop now. And trail Soth. Laser mic that call. We still can't risk blowing Soth's cover. Fisher, we need that phone call. Dime to a dollar, he's talking to Sedono. on our Mossad leak. I don't know, 80%, maybe 90. I just have a bad feeling about this train. I think our cover's blown. Hold on. No, it's just a feeling I have. I don't think it's safe to talk right now. Okay, but make it fast. I'm glad, stay worried. Shin bet, are you kidding? I could barely believe Mossad, much less. Of course, of course. Always assume they know what you're doing. Exactly. It's a joke. Right. Mein Gott, I can walk. Four more days, tops, then you're bulletproof. It's not safe to talk now. I need to get off this train. No, no, I can't. It's not possible. Of course. Till next time. Good work. Grim? Give me a sec. Focusing on the Timorese Mombe for expediency's sake. The new translator will take a few seconds to catch up. Take your time. There. Springfield demonstration. 80% plus fatalities. Custer would be proud. What the hell does that mean? Nothing good. What about that? Might be daily phone calls to delay release. Translator's still a little hinky. Right. We've got enough to work with. Get topside, Fisher. We're pulling you out of there. What is that? I was seeing things. There's... Huh? That right there. Grab whatever the hell is in your satchel. Time to peace the fuck up out of here. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now.
Talk to me about level of force. It's them or you. <laughs> So my guys just gonna sit there and watch the entire damn thing? An American agent. Bitch, fuck you and ya. Fuck you. <laughs> We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Talk to me about level of force. It's them or you. Ah, fucking fail! <laughs> Son of a bitch! There's somebody there. All right, I can run. I can run. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna fucking run full fucking speed. I'm gonna go to the damn helicopter, and that's gonna be the, the end of the damn mission. Maybe I was seeing. Things. Yeah, maybe you were seeing things. Come here, you, you fucking fuck. Come here. I'm tired of everybody's shit. Give me a satchel. Fuck you in what, whatever you got in your stash. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. Yeah. We're getting off the train now. You ain't the only one. Talk to me about nothing. It's them. Fucking run! Thank you! You could have done that at the fucking start, you dicks! <laughs> No, let's just wait. Let's just wait for him to run to us before we shoot down the damn helicopter that's shooting at him. <laughs> uh, intelligence gathered from Saul's laptop reference a potentially lethal Springfield demonstration, a potential terrorist event intended for an American target. Soth was allowed to continue onwards towards Jerusalem. <sighs> what the hell, man? I repeated that like four fucking times. Of Indonesia has submitted formal protests against supposed U.S. sorties across the Timorese border. And if Indonesia's government continues to hamper our efforts to combat terror, we will make our displeasure known. Has effectively driven the Deridandoa out of East Timor, crushing individual cells of guerrilla fighters. The situation in Indonesia should be resolved within have given U.S. troops for limited sorties onto Indonesian land, but only under supervision by Lambert, do you really think I need these two nannies? I'm a big boy, you know. Sam, on this mission, we have to work closely with the local authorities. It's related to the bank account we found on Salt Lake. <coughs> a large payment was made to a charity cover-up for a Syrian terrorist cell operating in Jerusalem. I knew the Penguin was a benefactor, and... You'll have more details once you get on site, big boy. What's your... Why'd you say it like that? Why? <laughs> big boy. <laughs> Lambert.
Robert over here catching feelings just like the rest of us. <laughs> Third Echelon has linked Sahadi Sodono, Sodono's Springfield demonstration to the black market purchase of an unknown biological agent. The T-Virus. <laughs> Rendezvous with Israeli intelligence agent Dali, Dalia, Dalia Tall in order to infiltrate the black market. Where the fuck is this at again? Z Israel? Here's a cultural opportunity for you. The birthplace of Judaism, Christianity, and Islam. So this is where all that peace and love came from. Exactly. Recent attacks have led authorities to put a curfew in place, which is what accounts for tonight's peace. In other words, you should have basically empty streets. Great. The fewer civilians, the easier my job gets. This looks like a touchy mission. Brunton is coordinating with local intelligence. Mossad? Even better. Shin Bet. Spooky. Who are we torturing? Just you. First thing you're going to need is to retrieve your SC-20K. Wouldn't it make more sense just to give it to me? We have the barrel altered to reduce sonic placement. Only one man with those skills in the area. An old arms dealer slash CIA plant working out of the back of a small shop. He'll be waiting for you. Details on your opsat. Did I just fucking float? שני, המשטרה נראית מאוד מתוחה. בדיוק, הם כבר לא שומטים בכלום. אתה חושב שתהיה עוד התקפה הלילה? אני לא יודע, אבל עדיף שלא נישאר באזור העיר העתיקה. אני יודע, אשתי ואני חושבים לעבור חזרה לתל אביב. נראה שהמצב פחות מסוכן שם. אתה באמת חושב כך? אין מקום מסוכן יותר מירושלים. Just part of the way the lights are, you know? Sometimes they just go out, sometimes it's just a bad light bulb, you know? Don't go over there. Don't go. My man, would you like to meet Malakath early? I will make that happen. Thank you. I don't know why you made that sound, but mm, it sounded like you quite enjoyed that. Uh -huh. <laughs> Gentlemen, there's a plan with y'all. I'm going to make y'all look the other way. Specifically, over there, somewhere.
Who's that? Do you work here? You cannot stay here. You have to go home. Let me just finish my orange juice. You can finish it in prison if you want. Okay, I'm going fine. I said now. Probably just the Fucking snitch. Come here, motherfucker. Snitches get stitches. In your case, all you get is a nap, so I'll let you off easy. What orcs do with traitors? Well, you know, you don't really have any uh, not, uh, any alliance to me, but but still, you a Whoever's snitch. There, come out with your hands up. Whoever's there, come out with your hands up. Whoever's there, you can suck my dick. <laughs> we just want the guns and the money, Saul. We'll take your life too if we have to, but we don't want it. We have no choice. We need to have them dead. Lay down your gun. There's nothing here. <gasps> Homeboy didn't even hear the gunshot. I got a Fisher, you are paid to be invisible. We just want the guns and the money, Saul. We'll take your life, too, if we have to. But we don't want it. We have no choice. We need to have them dead. You're Saul Berkowitz. Oh, thank God you showed up when you did. You are Mr. Brunton's man, no? Who were they? Thieves. They shouldn't have been able to get this close to me. There must be something wrong with my security arrangements. You've got something for me. Yes. Only a small thanks compared to what I owe you. gun in your hand? Much thanks. Your next objective is named Dahlia Tal. Brunton? Ms. Dahlia Tal. She's a Shin Bet agent in deep cover with local terrorist cells. She's our link to Norman Soth's terrorist connections. One of the choice nuggets of intel we pulled off Soth's laptop. Find Dahlia. She'll lead you to the mercenaries. You made some modifications. If you like to give it a try, I know a discreet place nearby. Hey, please. Can you tell me when the curfew ends? No idea. We had an incident in the Christian area this morning. Was it serious? Pretty serious, but less than the one last week. Now be quiet. God, this city is becoming more and more dangerous. 
Here we are. Feel free to play, but don't fire any bullets. I couldn't make it any quieter without sacrificing accuracy and range. Right, thumb six is. I calibrated the optics on your scope. I think you'll like the effect. Of course, it's still sensitive as a butterfly's wing. You'll probably have to hold your breath to get a steady shot. I... Oh, crap, get down. Somebody's coming. Why don't you do both of us a favor and drop this guy? A ring airfoil grenade should be quiet enough, and it'll certainly do the trick. He's standing in a puddle. <laughs> that idiot! I like the way you think. Sticky shock him! you can take care of that body. I already have our two earlier guests to attend to. Sure. Thanks for the work. The gun looks good. My pleasure. <sighs> Just don't do anything with it I'll regret contributing to. Now would I do such a thing? <sighs> now the only thing I hate about this game in the previous game is your weapon doesn't exactly hit where you aim at. Which can get a bit annoying. But other than that, it's freaking phenomenal. Now, I don't know about Chaos Theory. It's, I, don't, I think that's the first one that I played. But that was a long time ago, back on the GameCube days. Oh, shit, who the hell are you? You don't see anything. It has never been a safe place anyway. The curfew's not respected enough. We should be more severe. People are tired and bored to stay home. If they prefer to risk their life. This will never change. I don't like what happened in the grocery store. This is almost total anarchy now. They will never respect any of the Peace Roadmap anyway. Yes, I will keep on being busy. Speak for yourself. Who did it? Nobody claimed it. But you don't have to think twice to know. Will there be any reaction? I guess so. As usual. Another terrorist attack and the city will blow up. You know, we've been saying that for so long. Nothing changes. Only the number of dead in the list changes. It keeps growing. Fuck off, just so I can squeeze on through here. This guy right here, I just need to follow him closely.
I think I went the wrong way. I think I was supposed to go that way. Well, that guy is. Well, shit. Okay. Oh, I was. Who is that? Man, it is just your imagination. That'd be some scary ass shit. Some freaking, some freaking Ganados just pop up out of nowhere on this damn game. I have a clear identification of Dahlia. She's waiting for you near the church. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, only in the morning. Oh, thank Malakoth! Yes, I would like to save. Actually, matter of fact, I would love to save. Talk to. Is there a special hour for the Mass? Only in the morning. You took a long time. You're American. Who are you? I'm friendly and looking for a friend of mine. You've seen this man? I feel you wouldn't be asking unless I had. What was he doing in Jerusalem? Buying a weapon. Details, details. I don't know any. Something biological. The Syrians have supposedly had it for over a decade, but it was too dangerous to move until your friend came along with some kind of storage devices. What was the deal? Your friend got the biological agent. He gave the Syrians a small mountain of U.S. currency and one of the storage devices. Where are the Syrians? Where's the device? I'll take you to the device, but stay out of sight. Anybody sees us together, and we'll be far from the only people killed. Stay in the shadows. Man, this would be a good time to have Corvo's powers! Oh, by the way, y'all, we gonna be making a video on Dishonored 1 and 2 one day, including the DLCs. Except Death of the Outsider. I didn't really like that one very much. Believe it or not, that, that just was not my favorite one. What are you doing on the street? I'm sorry, officer. I'm heading home now. The curfew is very clear. You're endangering yourself and others. Of course. But my father, I have to take care of him since he was wounded in one of the attacks. I was changing his bandages and must have lost track of time. I didn't intend... Uh Good night.
Ha 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 ha! The stealthiest of orcs. Don't see me, don't see me, keep going, keep going. What are you doing outside? We're well past curfew. I'm so sorry. I just had to take care of my sick father. He was wounded in... Of course, but we can't make exceptions. I'll have to insist you return to your house immediately. Of course, officer. I'll be right on my way. I'll escort you. Excuse me? These streets aren't safe, curfew or no. I'll walk you home to make sure you arrive quickly and safely. That's not necessary. I don't mind at all. Here, let's go. That really won't be necessary. Could you at least get him out of the damn light? The hell's wrong with you? <laughs> Nicely done. Does this change our plan? No. The biological sample will only be at the Shoshana warehouse for another few hours. We Hold on. That damn music is way too freaking loud. Oh shit. Can't afford to let it get away. We just need to be more subtle. If I see you between here and the warehouse, i It's still way too loud. Why is it loud? Why is it loud? Oh, six. Oh, motherfucker. There we go to call off my part of the assignment. Right. Is there a way I could get up on the roofs? Yeah, that works. Over there, you should be able to get up. I'll meet you at the warehouse. Is it music or is it ambient volume? Let me see. Okay, yeah, it is music volume, okay. I see something moving! I was doing so good. Please turn around. You had every opportunity to walk, but you didn't. You, you, you had to go to sleep. You, you just wanted a nap. Who do the Syrians think you are? A double agent. They think I'm betraying Mossad. Why are you being so helpful? Our governments are allies. Our enemies are yours.
Who's there? Thank you for your cooperation, Conrad. God, I really wish... I really wish there wasn't a freaking GPU shortage. This shit sucks. A lot more stealthy in this game than I was in the last one. Fucking hell. Miss, excuse me. Oh, oh, thank goodness, a police officer. You startled me. You can't be... I was so worried because of the curfew. Imagine the type of character you could run into out here. You yeah. need to... I'm so... Just imagine. <laughs> <laughs> just, just imagine that's the last thing you hear before getting knocked the fuck out. Just a motherfucker in your ear, <laughs> holding you at gunpoint, going, <laughs> <laughs> "Oh my gosh, I'd pro uh, no one would believe me. No one would. That that would be fucking hilarious. That would be the way I'd want to get knocked out." You don't have to come to the warehouse. Teamwork isn't exactly my mo. You can take it up with your superiors. Brunton, I believe his name was. You can follow me from the shadows. Alright. Come on, my lady! Look, like you better tell me one spooky ass story. What are we gonna listen to? What kind of wow. Why does the shadows like that? Shadows are weird. How do I start this damn thing? Do I not come with you? You ready? We're stirring up a nest of vipers here. You want to come inside? Not on your life. Fisher, we need Dahlia Tal dead. Kill her. Don't think, just do it. Fisher, we needed her dead. Why? Shin Bet's not playing a straight game. It's not your job to question. I'm going to need a little more warning to shoot unarmed women. Are we aborting the mission? No, we can't. But you just dug yourself a deep pit to climb out of. Sign off, Brunton. We need to talk. Get the sample as soon as possible. You're in a fifth freedom situation. All what means are acceptable. <laughs>
All right, fuckers. I really hope. <laughs> I really hope I made the right decision and not killing her. What's that noise? Who is that? <laughs> Damn, Fisher. Dog. What are you supposed get out of the way? Fisher, what are you doing? I was pressing oh, RT. Darn. I was pressing RT and this motherfucker just stood there. Fisher. Had every opportunity to kill me right there. But you didn't. That was your biggest mistake. Here, people. I kind of want to go through here, though. We'll see if they got ammo. Because I need ammo. Do you got ammo? Why the hell is there a... Why is there light shining through here? They obviously got a lot of shit right there. What all do I have? I have a sticky in an air. Oof. All right. It's uh. I hear footsteps. Not what I meant to do. Ah! Oh. Ah. Shit! Shit! I shoot! Watch it! I am taking all your shit. That chick better not b betray me, man. I hope not. If so, and I'll just listen to... I forgot the dude's name. Lambert. I'll just listen to Lambert every single time. What are you doing? Why are you slotting? Why? Just grab it. <laughs> he tells me to kill somebody, I'll fucking do it.
think it's high time to fucking skedaddle. I might have freaked out a little, a little bit there. That's not good. Thank you for dying. I appreciate the head. Is that what I'm retrieving? We've got some bad intercepts, Fisher. You ever read the Chamberlain chapter of your history books? No need to act cute. Dahlia Tau is close and no doubt eager to repay your mercy. Shinbet wants the ND-133 and knows there's no official repercussions for killing somebody who doesn't officially exist. She's got sniper stats that could disprove Kennedy conspiracies, needless to say. Yeah, you said jump and I didn't. When I get back to the States, I'll sit facing the corner in a cone hat. <laughs> What is that? Smoke grenade? Yep, just in case. Good, 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 good. Okay. I guess the next time, I fucking shoot! You fucking prick! Oh, I, I am, uh, I, I am almost a dead. Where the hell's the other sniper at? Both y'all are beside each other. Oh, you fuckers. Is that all the snipers? I fucking hope. <laughs> ah, that's not all the snipers! More of you bitches. We're wasting our time. You and Cohen can get out of there. Mission's complete. Oh, thank you God. think that small box is the real thing? I hope to God not. There's certainly been suggestions in Syrian intelligence that they've been developing agents. All we can do is let Bellagio do his job and hope. You think smallpox is the Springfield demonstration? I don't want to guess. Meet Cohen and get out of there. Your soft spot for Dahlia has cost us more in the region than you can imagine. I didn't know. Okay, using device stolen from... Okay. South has made a Syrian-developed strain of the smallpox virus highly portable. Highly portable. Uh, Sodano? Yep, Sodano is now in possession of an unknown number of easily concealed biological weapons. Fantastic! Deridendoa forces have claimed victory after U.S. troops have retreated from two engagements near the... 
released an official statement on their strategic withdrawal from the small skirmishes on of Springfield, Texas after the non-voluntary smallpox vaccination. Health workers could not divulge. They should tell us what they know. It's our lives. Dramatic footage from Television Free Indonesia showing Dara Dandoa leader Suwadi Sadano apparently engaged in battle. It remains... There's too much noise on the line. I'm not sure we'll be able to connect you to Sarah before we land. We'll have the agency file on Pandora tomorrow, ready by the time you touch down. You're right. It's Sedano's insurance policy. If he misses a phone call, the virus gets released. We're vaccinating Springfield, Texas. But until we know how many other pox boxes there are, and where, Sedano is a glaring tripwire. We're going to have to tiptoe around him. Did Grimm write these smallpox flash notes? Yeah, she's a poet in her own way. But oh, she makes an interesting shit. point. We slip up in Indonesia, and those images could be illustrations of anywhere in America. Okay, never mind. I thought she was about to be assassinating this man at first. I'm sorry, Fisher. I can't get Sarah on the line. I don't know what I'd say to her anyway. Okay, Pandora tomorrow is the code phrase for Sedano's insurance policy against U U.S. attack. He makes daily secure phone calls to undisclosed U.S. locations, delaying release of the smallpox virus one more day. If he is killed or detained, the virus will be released within 24 hours. Intercept Sedano's Pandora's tomorrow or Pandora tomorrow call in order to locate the virus. We'll do this. And before anything is said, I'm going to leave this episode of Splinter Cell Pandora tomorrow here. This game is phenomenal, just like the last one. Uh, I think I'm just a... I think I'm just fucking retarded when it comes to some stuff. But I think I've gotten a lot better compared to the last one. Because I was able to freaking just skim through part of the stealthy parts. Or part of the... I was, I was able to like skim through the last mission for the most part. It, it, was, fair, it was fairly easy. I love stealth games. They're freaking awesome, especially games like Splinter Cell. I think my first, I think my first sneak, yeah, I think Splinter Cell Chaos Theory was my first stealthy game, but I didn't know how to be be stealthy. I I, I was a, I was a kid back then, so I, I liked running and gunning and all that shit. But Assassin's Creed, the first Assassin's Creed, was where I actually started to fall in love with being stealthy and shit. Now I went back to Chaos Theory. I I, I don't think I made it through the first mission. At all. I don't know why. I just never did. I just lost interest so quickly. I don't know why. I was a kid. <laughs> Kids lose interest and gain interest on another thing so damn fast. But anyway, until the next episode of Splinter Cell Pandora Tomorrow. So, anyway, with that, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. And I'll see you on the next one. And as always, my fellow orcs and orc kin, I hope y'all have a wonderful rest of your day.